Hello everyone, my name is Ayub Khouyi and I am an additive manufacturing engineer for MyMaker. And in this video, we are standing at Zortrax booth here at uh, Formnext in uh, Frankfurt. And I have with me here today, Paul. Yeah. Hi, I'm Paul Resner from the Zortrax company, responsible for the resin technology, mainly the developing new resins and working on the new machine connected with the resin technology. Amazing, great. Thank you very much for having us uh, here with you uh, today in your stand. So, as you all can see, we have the Inspire 2 with us here uh, today. So, what can you tell us about th uh, this uh, printer? What's new about it? What's unique about it? Yeah, the most interesting feature about the printer is we developed it to be the most automotive products of our line. We invented the special very static pump which led us to leave the printer even up to three days mm -hmm. we also invented the wiper which helped us to the wiper uh, mechanism yeah, yeah with the high viscosity resins mm -hmm. we need to wipe it also we invented the bottle holder connected mm -hmm. with the weight sensor so we are able to check if the bottle is running out of the resin mm -hmm. and also it is highly connected with the sensor inside the vat which mm -hmm. tells us how many resin there is left in the vat after this information that resin is running out, the pump is starting to pump it in. After the process, you can also pump it out, so you don't have to have a contact directly with the rest resin, which may be harmful. Mm -hmm. uh, also, the mounting of the platform becomes much more easier than previous version. Yeah, you can we, see that for sure. Yes, we use the popular uh, mounting from the bicycle seat, mm -hmm. and uh, you just need to take it out. To, yeah. Yeah. The calibration is much more easier since this mechanics we just do it one once when we get the machine and we don't need to repeat it every of the prints. So. Amazing. So for the uh, build platform, it can rotate up to which uh, degree? Yeah. Like even, the maximum degree that the, it can rotate to? Yeah, even after to 90 degrees. 90 yes, degrees? So, yeah. So how this will be beneficial? How can the user benefit from it? Yeah, the resin uh, safe because after oh. the print you can just hold the platform up and the resin will keep on dripping to the, uh, to the vat so you won't waste any of the resin. For yeah. sure, that's amazing, that's amazing. So basically we have a wiper, we have uh, also a resin level uh, sensor, uh, we have a resin pump, and we have the bottle resin uh, sensor. Yes, exactly. Weight. So, yeah. uh, weight sensor. So all of this is automated. Yes, it's all Everything automated. is automated. Yes. And it's synchronized with the uh, printer, so that you save the resin, wow. and you can print. For example, what happens in many uh, times, you have long prints. Yeah. And sometimes you have to add the, the resin near a cell. Yeah. In this case, you don't. You don't. You can leave the printer up to three days. Of up to three days. Printing. Yeah. Amazing. It's, it's, That's great. Yeah. So I can also see some fans here, actually. Yeah. So they uh, purify the uh, resin inside. Yeah. So we, what's the, uh, like, you know, what, how can they be uh, beneficial? Yeah, we wanted to make our printer as safe as is it possible. So we just put double filter system mm -hmm. which means we got one HEPA filter and one carbon filter for another time of fil filtration mm -hmm. so the user may not experience some bad smell or some sure. harmful sure. air the smell can be really strong yeah. of the resin yeah. sometimes for yeah. sure yeah. all right so the name is the pow the Zotrax powerful air trio yes we saw only one so where is yeah. the second and third one let me show you the resin uh-huh Next one device I want to introduce is our cleaning station. The cleaning station. The most interesting feature in this one is a newly invented filtering system, uh -huh. which let us much to keep isopropanol much more longer time. Uh -huh. So once we pour the isopropanol into the bracket, it uh -huh. comes by the pipes to the filters, uh -huh. leave all of the residues of uncured resin in the filters, and comes back to the uh, to the bracket but mm -hmm. without any residues so we can use it again we don't need to pour it away we just use the same amount of the isopropanol and it's really it's re it really it really to save the cost and Amazing. also save the environment because for sure it's eco-friendly yes yes because the uh, because the isopropanol is so bad for the environment especially yeah. when it's connected with the sure. resin residues. Sure, yeah. Yeah. So what's the difference between these two filters? Yeah. I can see one black one white. Yeah, the first one is a cloth type filter. Mm -hmm. It just filter the liquid by itself, the isopropanol. And uh -huh. this one is an aluminum net which let the uh, uncured residues mm -hmm. leave it on this net. And that's it. Amazing, great. That's really good. Yeah. So I can also see that the uh, build platform can be 
um, you know, put directly inside the cleaning station and be mounted there. So how does it work? Is it compatible with it? Yes, since we listen to the community, uh, some of the customers used to make little large prints and don't want to peel it off before they clean it up. Yeah. So we had to invent a special mechanism that let us mount the platform directly at the clinic station. Mm -hmm. It helps uh, at the really big volume prints, which will be hard to peel it off before it gets clean. But also you can use the casual bracket and For sure. Definitely. That's not a problem. Great, great, yeah. amazing. The mechanism looks the same as a printer. It's still yeah. the bicycle seat mechanism. Sure, so sure, yeah, it's, it's easy to exactly. assemble it. The That's intelligent hinge yes. is also compatible here yes. with the cleaning yes. station. That's great, exactly. that's great. So, the And then when you wash it, we need to cure it. Yeah, we need to cure it to achieve the properly mechanical pro uh, properties. Let me exactly. show you it. Inside, we got the three lines of the LED upside uh -huh. down, which let us to keep the same amount of light value for the whole of the model, because some of the models tend to be not the regular shape and it was problematic to cure them from the one side. So we decided to make the three lines of the LED and also one upside down to keep the same value of the power for the, all of the build plate. Also the mirror look like walls. Yes. But we prevent them from light reflections and even the light loss. Also, this plate prevent the UV light distribution outside the print. It was really necessary because we had to meet some safety requirements from it and eliminate every distribution light outside. Because as you can, as you know, the UV light is really harmful for the human eye. And, yeah, definitely. Yeah, amazing. Uh, as for the uh, slatting software that you use basically for the Inspire 2. So uh, I've heard that it's the Z suit. Yeah. Yes. So what's new about it? Uh, is there any compatibility with some other reasons? Yes, we get in a cooperative with our two partners, Loctite Henkel and uh, BSF. Because, as, as we can see here, these two, yeah. all right, which are the world leading resin manufacturers. Exactly. Yeah, for sure. Everyone knows them for sure. Yeah, yeah. Right. We had to move further since people need uh, much more stiffer, tougher resins, much more temperature resistance, and basic resins available on market couldn't effort like this. So we get in cooperative with the Loctite and uh, BSF. Yeah. Um, and by that, we validate all of the resins. We had to meet the mechanical properties to get the validation. And once it's done, we can sell it, use it, and even promote it on our website. We get also all of the parameters in our software, so client doesn't have to set up anything before he wants to print with it. He just choose the proper material and can start his journey. So, yeah. Interesting. That's really amazing. So the powerful trio is available in the market today. Yes. Amazing, great. Um, so the last point, uh, so uh, can you tell us more about the price point of the Powerful Light Trio or the Inspire 2 like as a printer? Yeah, I mean the price, so. Yeah. Yeah, basically we can sell the whole bundle. Uh -huh. The bundle contains the printer, the cleaning station and the curing station. Mm -hmm. But we understand that some of the customers need just the, the one of it, the printer, one of it, just curing, the or, yes, 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 yes. So, uh, the price for the printer is 3,690 euros. Uh, for this one, 3,200 euros. And this one price is similar to the printer since it's this LED, UV LED, because it much, so it's like 3,500 euros. When you buy a bundle, it will cost about 11,000 euros. It's a catalog price, of course. Uh, if you speak with someone from the sales team, I'm sure they can prepare some offer. Yeah, sure, definitely. Amazing. Thank you very much for this interview. Thank you, Thank very, you very much, much. for having us. Um, that was really, really amazing and great. Thank you very Thank much. You very much. Cheers.